The same hacker that we told you about last week targeted Anson County again. Yeah, they shut down three of the county's websites. They posted this image here. It shows a man in a Guy Fox mask holding an anti-government sign. Reporter Tina Terry went to Anson County where the sites are back up and running tonight. And the Anson County manager and other staff members here went through this on Friday. Then they came back Monday and noticed a hacker had taken down their website again. That hacker posted this anti-government message on the county's website. Today, the county manager told me things are back to normal and no sensitive information was compromised by this. Last week, we told you the same thing happened to the city of Concord's website and files at the Lincoln County Sheriff's Office were held for ransom. And to safeguard against it happening again, leaders in Anton County will convert the old website to a new one with more security features. Now that will cost about $23,000 and it'll cost about $3,000 a year for maintenance, but we are told that this is something that the county had already budgeted for. Back to you. Thank you, Tina.